Noah Beck shows us his morning routine and talks about his mental health in his most recent YouTube video. Here is everything we know. I'm Margie Mays and this is your 24-7 Celebrity News. Noah Beck released a video to his 1.44 million YouTube subscribers called I Have to Tell You Something. And in the nine and a half minute video, he shared so many personal secrets and information to his subscribers. He shared his morning routine and talked about his mental health. So here is exactly what Noah does when he wakes up. First, if it's a day where he doesn't have a lot to do in the morning, he sleeps in. Next, he gets a text from his manager, usually telling him he's got stuff to do. That, by my friends, he mentioned is not his favorite part of the day. I can understand why. Then he takes a shower. He likes to take cold showers. He went on a little bit of a ramble to say that he thinks there's a lot of good benefits for cold showers, including immunity and good for your skin. Then he brushes his teeth. Very, very vigorously, might I mention. He must have great breath. Dixie would probably know. <laughs> After the shower, he shaves his face. Quote, all that needs to go. I can't do facial hair, referring to his beard that was growing in over a couple days. Then he does his skincare, he washes his face, and he said he loves bubble products. Everybody, go check them out. Then he goes to the gym. He loves to pump iron, run a little, play basketball. He works with a trainer named Kevin at the gym in West Hollywood called Dog Pound, where a lot of TikTok stars have been spotted working out. So guys, that is it. That is his morning routine. Sounds nice and relaxing and healthy and I'm living for it. And speaking of health, he then goes on a walk later in his video and he talks about his mental health. And let's see what he has to say. Fast forward to 7 p.m. He takes us on a walk where he gets really personal and opens up about his mental health. He says, quote, I've been resorting to walks lately as like therapy in a way. I'm going through it, honestly. I said it. I'm not like saying I'm depressed. No, no, I'm not depressed. It's just like little mental things that just like get to me. I overthink and I need ways to clear my mind. Hence the walking. He talks a lot about how he likes to go on walks, play sports like basketball and soccer, and work out, all of which help to clear his head when he feels overwhelmed or in the feels. He said, quote, physical therapy is like my thing. Active activity just gets my mind off things. He also offered some advice to his followers about how to improve their mental health. He said, quote, if you guys are going through it as well, my kings and queens out there, do something active. Noah loves to stay, stay in shape, not only to help him physically, but also mentally. In the video, he did keep toggling with the notion of depression. He hesitantly said, quote, I keep wanting to say depressed, but like, I'm not just, Things have been getting to me lately. The internet sucks. Some other things in my life are just getting to me. And if you don't have an outlet, it's very self-destructive. You have to do something about it if you're feeling some type of way. I think it is really great that he's urging his followers. I mean, he's got over 7.4 million followers on Instagram, 1.44 followers on YouTube, and not to mention the whopping 26.2 million followers on TikTok. He's really telling them to notice their mental wellness and to do something about it. And giving them these actionable ideas is such a wonderful thing. He left that video both actionable and positive at the end saying, quote, at the end of the day, you have to be selfish because you are the only person who can take care of your own mental health. He urged fans not to do drugs and not to do drinking. He said, quote, that never ends well. I don't know why people do that. It is really nice to see Noah relate to his fans and get real beyond the TikTok videos and to see his struggles too. He said, quote, it's not all sunshine and rainbows over here, but he kept it optimistic and reminded everyone to just keep pushing and it will all be okay. So you guys, have you checked out the video? Did you laugh? Did you check out his morning routine? Are you gonna adopt his morning routine? And are you gonna take into practice all those actionable ideas about what mental health and wellness? I highly encourage it. We wanna know what you think. I'm Margie Mays and follow us at Hollywire for your 24 seven celebrity news.